All right, if you guys are watching this, you guys have officially hit the perfect YouTube channel of some average Joes that are working on some average sleds. So this today's video is our very first video. It is Thanksgiving today. Um, we just ate, so now I'm out in the garage recording for you guys. And I'm gonna explain to you what this channel is all gonna be about, you know? Um, so me and our buddies, myself included, go out and we just have a ball on sleds, four wheelers, um, whatever is just cool that we see. Um, so we're gonna be going to Snowcross um, this winter and we are going to, doing some vintage racing. So the DL one longer, 100, we're going to race on that. Um, but the reason why this channel is called SX Triple Power is the SX chassis from Yamaha back in the 90s is our probably our favorite chassis. Um, I'll turn around and show you guys the two SX chassis that we have. Um, before I show them to you guys, I'm going to tell a little bit of story of why we like the SX chassis so much. Um, they are kind of a sentimental, you know, value to us because way back in the day, our dad had a SX chassis, so it was an SX 700 triple. Um, and he had that and us kids rode around the yard and we loved it. And then we moved away and then we had to sell them. So, and then this summer, me and my younger brother found another SX chassis and we surprised our dad with it. And we bought it, put it in the garage and we covered it and he came in and uncovered it. It was really special, um, but that is the why the channel is named the way it is. So I'm gonna show you guys the sleds and here they are. So this is a 1997 VMAX SX triple 700. Um, so this is the project. This is the main project. You guys might see a lot more on this. So obviously you can see the jack. The jack is, we're working on the front end suspension because these sleds are so low in the front that we're trying to lift them up. So either you can achieve that by putting bigger shocks in the front and lifting up the front end. So we got some player shocks there. Um, but and there's the other one. So this one is stretched out to a 136. But back to this one. This is our M10 suspension. This is going into that 1997 700. Sorry for the mess, but um, we're stretching it out to 136. So we got some rails from Track USA. Um, so this extends it out from 121 to 136. So, and the shocks are being rebuilt by Carver Performance. Um, so once those get here, we can throw the skid underneath it and we'll be good to go. So um, now on to the next one that was sitting here that you guys just saw. It's a 1998, I believe, VMAX SX 600 twin. And <laughs> you guys could tell that Facebook Marketplace has done us good. Um, but we found this, this is actually in pretty good shape. We have found this, um, with a 136 already swapped into it. Um, it's got the Owens front shocks on it. Um, it's got an inch and a quarter track on it. So this is a, a very good template to swap the 700 into, um, to swap the 136 into. Um, I'll have you guys take a look. <clears throat> so there's the Owens shocks on it. And, uh, the windshield is off of it right now because we're actually going to paint the windshield. Um, there's the 136. So originally this is a 121. So we polished the, the tunnel up nice, but um, but yeah. Then this is a twin. This isn't a triple, but it's still the SX chassis as you guys can see there. But uh, we got two more sleds outside. Um, I have an SRX, a 1998 SRX, 
and we have a 1988 Yamaha Exciter. So I'll go outside and I'll show you guys those. Now guys, we are outside the garage. Um, I'm gonna show you guys the two other sleds that we have here. So we have a total of four sleds. Um, this is my 1998 SRX 600. So this was the fastest of the fastest back then. So, which is still, it's pretty quick. I think it's pretty quick. It's got a lot of miles on it. Um, but I went through everything on this, cleaned the carbs, went through the skid. Um, it's got an XTC skid in it, um, and it's got a DG silencer on it. Um, I'll show a video of it idling right now. And then here is our 1988 Yamaha Exciter 570. Um, this thing is just a good runner for sure. Um, it's super fun to ride these because this one is a lot lighter than the SRX over there, but it's pretty clean. There's no scratches in the seat, no nothing. So, all right, and I'll show a video of this thing running. But, all right, I'm going to go back in the garage because it is cold out here. So, see you back in the garage. All right, guys, I'm back in the garage, and that's basically it for today's video. I know um, it was just a lame video, but I'm just explaining what the channel's about. Um, this is my first time doing a YouTube thing, so we'll have to just grow with me and see how it goes. Um, but there's lots of more content and stuff to come. Like I said, snow cross, vintage racing, and screwing around on old sleds with my buddies. So um, you guys just stay tuned. Um, me and Zoe are going to go inside. So, all right, you guys have a good Thanksgiving. See ya.